as they say, out of the mouths of babes. Tonight, I'm going to introduce you to you, an amazing girl who has spent the last two years of her life working to help in the fight against cancer. She's only 11 years old. Mimi Rivers of Huntington, Maryland is tonight's Harris's hero. I really feel sad that people who have cancer, but when I help people, I think I'm doing something good. Only in the fifth grade, and Mimi Rivers spends much of her free feel. time knitting and selling hats for $5 a piece. She donates most of the proceeds to the American Cancer Society. You start off with this and you go like that. A few months ago, Mimi's grandmother saw my story on another group of Harris's heroes, members of a men's high school track team in Stafford. They were knitting hats for cancer patients. When I saw her the next day, I told her about that story. I said, they're doing the same thing you've been doing since you were nine. Mimi wrote me a letter. Writing to let you know that younger kids like me are also knitting. Her spirit really impressed me, so I invited Mimi to take a very special tour of our studio. Okay. Now this is what this is where I sit. Mimi kicked Allison to the curb and then joined me as my special little co-anchor. Well, that's the camera that I'm usually saying stuff on. I look at those words and I say those words, and it looks like I'm looking right at you while I'm talking. Well, that's your camera. I want you to read that, and then when you get to the bottom, I want you to turn and read it right there. Today on ABC 7 News. A quick look at Doug Hill's corner. He is so good. He can actually turn and point to all this stuff like he knows exactly where it is. Can you see where Washington is? Uh, right there. Oh. Looks to me like Mimi can wear more than just one hat. <laughs> see, that wasn't so hard, was it? Good job. See, that means one day you can take my job. <laughs> she got too comfortable up there, let me tell you. But we love Mimi. She's knitted more than 50 hats, and she says that she is going to keep on going because she's dedicated her life to serving others, and we congratulate you for doing that, Mimi. Way to go.